Buster Murdoch blasts baseless rumors surrounding 2015 death of classmate Stephen Smith. Buster Murdoch, Alex Murdoch's eldest son, is speaking out against what he describes as baseless rumors surrounding the 2015 death of his high school classmate, Stephen Smith. These baseless rumors of my involvement in Stephen's death are false, he said in a Monday statement shared by his family's attorney, Jim Griffin, on Twitter. Smith, who was 19 at the time of his death, was killed in what police initially described as a hit-and-run just miles from the Murdoch's Island Ton, South Carolina, hunting property called Moselle, where Alex fatally shot his wife, Maggie, and his youngest son, Paul, on June 7, 2021. Buster said he has tried his best to ignore the vicious rumors about his involvement in Stephen Smith's tragic death as he grieves his mother and brother. I haven't spoken up until now because I want to live in private while I cope with their deaths and my father's incarceration, he wrote, adding that he has been targeted and harassed by members of the media and the public. Alex Murdoch fallout, death of Buster Murdoch's high school classmate back in spotlight after verdict. He continued, I unequivocally deny any involvement in Stevens' death and my heart goes out to the Smith family. Smith's mother wrote in a GoFundMe page description last week that she has raised enough money to exhume Smith's body. Public demands answers in suspicious death of Buster Murdoch's classmate after Father Alex's conviction. The South Carolina Law Enforcement Division has reopened an investigation into Smith's death. Attorney Eric Bland, who represents the children of the Murdoch's late housekeeper, Gloria Satterfield, who died at the Murdoch's Moselle home in an apparent 2018 fall, is now representing the Smith family. He was found in the middle of a country road in Hampton County, and the highway department said he was hit by a car, but there was no broken glass, no car parts, Bland told Fox and Friends co-host Pete Hegseth earlier this month. His clothes were intact, his shoes were on, and he had a clear head trauma injury that looked like it was done by something other than a car. On March 2nd, a Culloden County jury found Alex Murdoch guilty in the 2021 murders of his wife and son at Moselle, prompting suspicion about Smith's mysterious death. Prosecutors say the disgraced lawyer killed his wife and son in an effort to divert attention away from his mounting alleged financial crimes.